Hi, this is Journey Mike Garvin coming to you from Chicago as usual, and it's a big day here at Law Talk. I've busted out my new uh, fall green screen backdrop. There it is. Photo once again, courtesy of my cousin Carrie. Thank you, Carrie. <laughs> I've also gone uh, full lumberjack today just because it's, it's cold and it's fall, so I was, I was feeling it. He's a lumberjack and he's okay. He sleeps all night and he works all day. But uh, we, we've got a good clip. It's, it's a more sovereign citizen fail in court and it's good stuff. Let's do it. From the secret headquarters of the Sovereign Citizen Patrol, initiating video production sequence. We are no longer playing. So let's get revved up. It's time for Law Talk with Mike. Does this being recorded? I'm being violated. My due process is being violated. I have the right to speak to the record. And if you want to sir, take a stand down, I'm and, you, I'm you a question. and the question is, what's the question? The question is, you wish to represent my attorney, of course, to this charge, SCP, those are the attorney of I need, I, I need to know what laws we're, we're working under, because I already objected to any public defender, uh, of the well, you can tell the audio is really bad. I'll do what I can to fix it up, but I don't. I don't know if it's fixable. All, all you need to know is that uh, the, that this guy's got a fez on, and the judge is having absolutely none of it. They are incompetent. I am private counsel. I'm an authorized representative. I'm the authorized representative for the trust. I'm the trustee of the account. I'm not interested. <laughs> After all that nonsense, the judge just said, okay, are you pleading guilty or not guilty? <laughs> I mean, everything he said was wrong, but he's like, I, I'm not going to bother addressing this. In any plea. In that case, the court will start guilty. Okay, so the people. Are you, are you, are you, are you an Article 3 judge? Is this the Article 3 court? I'm not here to challenge the charges. I'm here to challenge the jurisdiction. You told me that you have jurisdiction. Motion for jurisdiction based on what account? Are you a party in the? I don't know if you'll be able to hear it. He, he, he right there. He just said your motion for jurisdiction has been denied, <laughs> which is absolutely correct. He's making an oral motion about, regarding jurisdiction. The judge just denied it. That's it. Okay, what do the boys have to do to get you to hit like and subscribe? It's pretty much all I have. Well, no, the state uh, on the uh, wait, 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 state will be ready on the, the 7th of October, Judge, when we usually try the cases for uh, the property. Right, so objection, so objection. Is this party of is this party of people? Is this party? Again, he just says you can't hear him. The judge just said, objection overruled. The people object. Let the record reflect that the judge is violating due process of law. What law are we working under? I'm here on the Treaty of Peace and Friendship, 1786-1787. Yeah, that's cute, but it's not applicable. He's, he's uh, uh, denied, he's overruled your objection and he's denied your oral motion for, uh, regarding jurisdiction. He's entered a guilty plea on your behalf, and he set this thing for trial. Recently signed by here's President Barack Hussein Obama, and I'm here to enforce the Constitution, the rights of indigenous people, and the human rights charter. Yeah, yeah, that's great. You're also there because you're a defendant in a, in a criminal case, and, uh, you know, you just you just pled not guilty to it. Now it's being set for trial. Now we're here on the doctrine of discovery, which is a Christopher Columbus story. I object. This is not an Article Three court. You are not an Article Three judge. These are all statutes, ordinances, and resolutions that do not apply to the natural people of America. Watch how the judge is cleaning up his desk, <laughs> signing orders, any, anything but listen to this nonsense. <laughs> Objection to the 
Objection. Have you received Have you received my document of discovery? Yes, I have, sir. Have you received my written uh, uh, affidavit, my proclamation? Yes, sir. Have you received the United States John Kerry sign sealed on that trademark, that trade name? Sir, be here October 7th. We'll give you a bench warrant for your arrest. Thank you. I thought this was a trial. Yeah. It says, sir, be here on October 7th. There'll be a bench warrant for your arrest. <laughs> The, the judge went through. He did everything he was supposed to. He ordered it in open court. The prosecutor picked it up. I picked it up, even though the audio is horrible here. And uh, and he just has no interest in listening to this insanity. Uh, carry on. Uh, let him leave the bench. Um, let it reflect that the judge left the bench. Uh, still has not stated for the record what laws. Yeah, banned the ship. That the record reflected the, the he case has shit. been dismissed because the judge uh, 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 abandoned the bench. Ah, I love it. The judge should know such thing. The uh, the judge asked him the questions. He he entered a not guilty plea form, set it for trial, uh, announced what his ruling is, and and uh, signed the drafted and signed the order. At that point, it was over. The judge could have easily just held this guy in contempt for talking him over. He was completely out of line in court. But instead of doing that, he just thought, yeah, you know, this is this is the end of the call. I've I've set that that case. For, for, for trial, that's my ruling for the day, and I'm leaving. That, that's it. The, it. There's no other way to put it. All right. I probably shouldn't do this. I don't know if it's gonna work. A fez, a fez, and a flannel. I just, I don't know. I just had to get a thinking cap out one time since since we, we are dealing with the uh, with the more sovereign citizen here. Here at Law Talk, we like to have fun with uh, silly stuff that happens in court and every once in a while and completely by accident, I assure you, you might learn something. Thanks for watching.